scams, how often they've actually affected heavy businesses and so forth. A good amount of smart people in one room Friday morning putting their code cracking skills to the test. With KPMG in Calgary hosting its second annual Cyber Hackathon. This year, the event is open to both professionals and university students, allowing participants to compete as individuals or in two-person teams. The challenge, based on a capture the flag format, rewards the first to solve it with a $3,000 prize and the title of champion. It's super important, just because uh, it's a ever-coming threat, and I'd say it's becoming more concerning in today's age of technology and AI and stuff. Some of the computer geniuses understand that with the ever-growing industry of technology, scams and cyber threats will increase, but also can be used to educate yourself on the risks of having personal information online. You see how people be behind computers and, you know, it's just become a world of understanding social activities and how it can be manipulated in various ways so it's both a threat but it's also knowledgeable for people to understand like how vulnerable they can be with all this information that they share on the internet. Online threats have been an issue for many organizations which is why KPMG hosts events like this to get a deeper understanding of how and when networks could be hacked. Uh, KPMG just did a recent survey and, and, and specifically from an Alberta standpoint, we saw almost 80% of them respond that cyber crime and cyber security is one of their concern areas. Yes, uh, while the technology is great uh, for advancement, for, for uh, innovation, but at the same time we need to be more aware of the flip side of the technology in terms of the cyber security challenges which come along with that. In Calgary, Callum Hawker, City News.